And now sports with Chris Dewar from the Little Jess Chrysler Dodge Jeep and Ram Sports Desk. Well, of our Southeast Iowa Diamond hopeful, Central East Softball has to be considered the strongest bet to make a run at a state berth. That said, the Lady Hawks were dealt a bit of a mystery opponent in their regional opener with Comanche today. At least they got to do this at home. Central Lee would find out very quickly that the Storm had some power in the lineup. Fortunately for them, they also had Miss Jaylee Hawk out patrolling left field. What a job she did. First two batters pounded balls. In each case, Jaylee would take away potential doubles from each of them. She certainly showed off the range almost above the wall right here to grab the second one as well. Good start for Central Lee. This game was scoreless until the bottom of the second. Kenna Sandoval stepping to the plate right here. Nearly leaves the yard. She hits the top of the fence. She would take a double plus extend that run with a nifty little run of her own at that point down to third base. She'd later score on a fielder's choice at that point. More to come in this one as well. How about this little piece of hitting right here to start things back up by Jalen Hawk helping her own cause. Sets the table for uh, Elena Barlow right here. The RBI double extends the lead out to four to nothing at that point, and the runs just kept coming in the bottom of the second. It was the only scoring frame for either team. Nice piece of hitting by uh, Miss Peasley right there that makes it a five nothing lead. Central Lee pounded out eight runs in the bottom of the second, and they win tonight by the final count of eight to nothing. The Lady Hawks will travel to Washington for their next round on Saturday at seven o'clock. Up the road, it was Fort Madison and Keokuk playing in. Class 4A, and man, what a huge second inning in this one it was. Nine runs, mostly on walks for Fort Madison. Here in the third, trying to extend a 10-1 lead. Good start in this one by Elizabeth Tanner. Check out the defense, though, right here by Miss Ames out in the, the outfield to take away extra bases from Kylie Lamino. Still, Ava Taylor is going to contribute and contribute big for her squad right there. Another RBI rip, which staked her team to an 11-1 lead. It would be Fort Madison getting the win in upset fashion on the road. Eight 18 to 7. Up next for the Hounds, a trip on Saturday to take on Cedar Rapids Xavier. Well, since we last checked in with Macomb Special Olympian William Reynolds, he has certainly continued the medal binge. In fact, he went out and found a different sport to totally dominate and again fill his suddenly overflowing trophy case. Since we last saw you with bowling, how many new medals have you won? Three. What were those medals for? One from softball throwing, and the other one from state in softball throwing, and one from track. What McCombs William Reynolds is too modest to tell you is that his latest Special Olympics medals binge included a personal best throw and a state right. championship that certifies just how much he has perfected his softball throw. Yeah, yeah, I practice a lot for state and when I was practicing I I beat my score from regionals. No kidding? Yes. So why are you so good at the softball throw? Because I I lift weights and I do my exercise bike too. And given now his victories across multiple sports I think it's fair to say William Reynolds has a flair for excelling on the big stage. I don't get nervous. I feel very comfortable at doing it, so. Is there a key to that for you, or is that just natural for you? Natural. Okay. So what's next for you? Because I know we're pr probably right around the bend from starting back up with bowling. Yeah, I'm going to do bowling next. And then I'm going to try a new sport this winter, basketball. So. Awesome. Yes. Uh, why basketball? Because I, I, no, I don't know what I like about basketball. I, I like basketball a lot. So. But William is motivated in competition by more than just the end result. Socializing with my friends from the Special Olympics. What does Special Olympics mean to you more than anything? Being a lathy and competing. 